How's it going guys? You may have seen from the title and thumbnail, Horizon 5 is getting a brand new game mode. It was just announced just a couple of days ago, so we're going to talk about that today as it's rare that Forza Horizon 5 gets new game modes. We're going to discuss what this could be. The game is also getting a new partnership as well. What on earth could that be? Let's talk about it. So where was this announced? Well, if you go to Forza Horizon 5 right now and check your in-game message center, you will have received a message from the Forza community team saying the following. See you at Gamescom. Our booth will be showing a completely new exciting game mode inspired by our community and their creations. Plus, we will, we will also be showing our latest in-game partnership too. Sounds really interesting. Now Gamescom is like a gaming convention. Things get announced there, things get shown there for the first time. And Gamescom is this month. It's on the 21st of August until the 25th of August. So whatever this game mode is, I don't think we're gonna find out until around then. So it's a few weeks away. And the next update for Horizon 5, I believe is, yes, High Performance Dailies on August the 15th. So I don't think this new game mode is going to be a part of the next update so we're not really going to talk about the next update in this video because i don't think this is going to be part of it i think this is going to come out after gamescom that's the whole point of it being maybe shown at gamescom so what could it be well they they drop a few hints as to what it could be in the actual message itself they say that it's inspired by our community and their creations now this being a game mode what can we create as a community that's kind of game modey? It obviously screams something to do with Event Lab. Now, I can't really put my finger on what it could be. There are loads of different options, but if I was to guess something Event Lab created, maybe they use our creations in Event Lab to make some game mode out of. Maybe they can add rival leaderboards to Event Lab creations. Obviously, this is basically a discussion now. So in the comment section below, put your guesses, put your opinions on what the game mode is going to be all about. And there's a few clues that I can show you. So there's obviously two things coming. There's a new game mode and a new partnership. Let's focus focus on the new game mode first. In the past, we have had a new game mode leaked for Forza Horizon 5, but it was leaked such a long time ago, and we've not seen it in the game yet, that I've always been led to believe that it was cancelled. And we've spoken about it a few times, but we're going to have to quickly talk about it again because it's now relevant. And it's the Eliminator game mode. The Eliminator game mode is already in Horizon 5, but a Duos game mode was leaked a... I think it's a couple of years ago now, so it's a long time ago. Loads of information was leaked alongside it, such as the features that's going to be within this game mode, some of the cars that would come with it, how it works. It was quite a hefty leak, and what we also got was a bunch of audio clips of the announcers within the Eliminator as well. We've got a new progression system, and Aleja has changed the cars. And I've heard the Illuminati have been seen setting up mysterious triangular collectibles around Mexico. It seemed like a really credible leak at the time, but because we've just never seen it, I always just presumed that it was kind of scrapped. Now, with Play On Games telling us here that we are getting a new game mode, could it be the Eliminator update? I'm going to say no. And the only reason I'm saying no is because it does say in the message this game mode is inspired by our community and their creations. I don't really see how an Eliminator Duos game mode has got anything to do with the community or their creations. So I'm quite happy to say that I don't think this new game mode is going to be this long, long talked about Eliminator Duos game mode. There's one more thing that could possibly be related. Again, I'm kind of stretching here a little bit, but these two icons were leaked a while ago and these look like they could be hill climb related. Just throwing a theory out there. They say that they are inspired by our community and our creations. Maybe they're going to turn a few of our event lab creations, sort of hill climb creations perhaps, into an actual hill climb game mode maybe kind of like a leaderboard rivals thing is as a community we create our own event lab sort of time tracks maybe our own hill climbs and play games are implementing the game mode to make it an actual game rather than just a race i don't know i'm just throwing it out there i'm, I'm having a look at the clues that we have because other than that you know we haven't really got any idea what this could be other than looking at what they've said so it's a possibility we can add it to the list if you think about it we've not really had any new game modes in Forza Horizon 5 they obviously expand the current game modes 
like they expand the horizon stories they change up the horizon stories a little bit like the test track that was a little bit different we've not seen that before um, but in terms of new game modes can't really think of any so this should be a fresh experience i hope the, the, the partnership sounds interesting as well probably going to be difficult to guess what the partnership is as it could literally be anything i've seen a few people guess that this is going to be the final donut media update partnership because it, you could call it a partnership donut media and Forza horizon 5 we are still kind of waiting for that part three donut media that we've still not seen maybe this is it maybe this is the new partnership i don't know i think if, if you've not been keeping up to date with donut media lately there are some weird things happening behind the scenes people are leaving um james actually left himself lately i'm pretty sure which is a big deal so i don't know if the fort 2005 and donut media relationship is as strong as it used to be it could be literally anything we've had a lot of leaks lately that are giving us brand names in text strings such as body kit names body kit companies like future design carbon artwork body shop there's a lot if you keep up to date with my videos you will have seen how many different text strings and leaks and brand names have been found in the files nowadays and it could very well be one of them we've had a lot of car packs lately one of the latest ones was the universal studios kind of car pack where they added the back to the future cars and the jurassic park car that was a very sort of random sort of car pack given to us that was kind of a partnership with universal it could be something like that again it could be a car pack to accompany this game mode that has a theme to it like universal where we got some of the movie cars from back to the future so it's interesting it's something to look forward to but what i don't think it is is anything to do with donut media so the chances are for me the partnership will be something random like we've had doritos partnership before we've had a barbie partnership before we've had literally the most random thing in the world so pop your guesses in now something else to mention which is kind of related to this whole gamescom announcement thing Forza horizon 6 is obviously a talking point now because we're we're looking forward to it we're not in a rush to get it the longer they take the better the game will be that's fair enough but we haven't seen an announcement this year which means that it might not be till the end of next year until we get it that's fine we did predict that there was a possibility that it was going to be teased or announced at Gamescom. Well, now that we've been told that Forza Horizon 5 is going to be at Gamescom showcasing a new game mode, I don't think Forza Horizon 6 has any chance of being shown at Gamescom. So Forza Horizon 6, we can, unless there's any massive surprises, we can probably put on the back burner until next year at least, which is a shame really. One of my next videos will be focusing on the next update, which is high performance dailies. We'll take a look into that, what clues we have. Maybe we'll get a teaser for that like we usually do. But I don't think this game mode is going to be part of that. We'll have to wait for a few weeks really probably till around gamescom until we know what it actually is let me know what you think in the comment section below guys we'll continue talking about this until we find out more leave a like if you've enjoyed and i'll see you all later